Hey everybody, it's Steel City Outdoors. We're going for some largemouth bass. We got a seven foot medium action rod, 12 pound test line, and the rig we're gonna be using today is a Texas style rig with a drop shot. We're gonna use a split shot instead because we don't want too much weight, we want a slower drop. So instead of using a bullet weight, which is normal in a Texas style, we're going with a split shot instead. We got a three out bass hook on there, worm hook, and we have a pumpkin seed power grub worm ready to rock and roll. So let's see what happens today. There we go. There we go. Steel City largemouth. That's how you want to do it. So in case you didn't realize all right, already all you sports fans, you grab largemouth bass by their mouth. Just like I have them right there. And that is a Texas rig worm with a bass. Not bad, not bad at all. For the release. All right, everybody, we're gonna switch over our methods here. We're gonna switch to what some people would call a fluke or a jerk bait. This is a finesse fish right here. We're gonna use that bass hook that we were using earlier with the shank bent so that it gives this jerk bait an action. We're going with the pearl white shad color right now. That's why it's got the blue on the top and the white on the belly. Give it a couple chances here. Fish seem to be dulled, dialing out a little bit on us right now. We're not really getting too much action, but we're coming into the late evening. So sun's going down, getting in that power hour when the fish should be hitting the surface. So this is a very shallow running lure, about one foot off the surface. It'll even jump out of the surface sometimes. So let's give it a shot, see what happens. Yep, got him. Not a big one. Fish is a fish. Fish is a fish. Nice. So we got one on the other rig to show off a little bit. That was on that finesse fish jerk bait we were talking about earlier. Not bad at all. All right, for the release. All right, everybody, we're gonna switch again. Seaweed was too much, too thick. We're gonna try to go back to the bottom. We got a, um, a Zoom crayfish lure, super flapper. As you can see, the arms do a lot of work here, but it's rigged with a drop shot rig, as you can see. So we're gonna make sure that we get to the bottom slowly with that drop shot. Sticking with the seven foot, 12 pound test line. Let's give it a shot and see what happens. Got him. Nice fish. Nice fish. Real nice fish. You got this on film, babe? It's a nice one. This is a real nice one, guys. Real nice one on that big crab, Daddy. Real nice bass. That's what we came here for. That's what we're here for. That's a big fish, everybody. Yes. Sir, on the crayfish. Wow. All right, we're gonna get away on this fish. What a beast. Probably about a three and a half pound fish. Probably about 19 inches. That's the, that's the footage we've been waiting on all night. All right, let's see here. Four pounds exactly. Nice. Gotta be careful not to hurt him. See how long he is.
Yep, 20 inches. All right, 20 inch, four pound largemouth bass. Caught on that crayfish. Fishing Steel City. That's how you do it, y'all. That is how you do it. Again, going slow, slowing down, getting those fish hitting whenever they're on the drop. That's what we get. Crayfish. Yeah.